Hello everyone, I am the Lonely Doctor of Time Lord Gaming, and we are bringing you a Level 1 Tips, and Tricks, and Guides playlist. This will be installment number one, one of many things that you can do at Level 1. They will be awesome, they'll be interesting, they'll be weird, they'll be a little bit of everything. So right now, we're going to focus on what you can do at Level 1 in the beginning, just after you're unbound. So the first thing we're going to focus on is getting our one-handed up. We can get our one-handed skill up and level up I don't know how many times. It depends on how long you do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on the gameplay. Go to settings, go to gameplay, go down to difficulty. I'm going to put it on expert. I don't want to put it on master or legendary because that's just way too much. Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to put it on expert. And then as soon as we get through here... The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. So walk closer to him. There you go. You may as well take Gunyer's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. Okay. Well, I will take his axe. So then you go to items, go to weapons, oh, the axe. Right. Get that armor on, and give that axe a few swings. I'm going... Ah, this long. And you just keep attacking him. He will not attack you, and you will not get a bounty. There's, n It won't break your game. It won't break your game. Don't worry. So you're just going to keep doing this, and eventually, you will just keep leveling up. What are you doing? What? The Imperials, take cover. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm on your side! Death to the Empire! Get away! So then you can do this for a very long time. There is one room coming up soon in which you can keep doing this and he won't even leave the room. You can just keep attacking him and you won't leave the room unless you do something specific to activate him to leave. So just take the key and just keep attacking him. He's gonna somehow... What are you Unlock that door. Let's get out of here. He's gonna somehow live through all this, by the way. Uh, you're slashing him over and over with an axe, and he's just his limbs are not falling off. Uh, he squirts blood, but his clothes aren't ripped. Gosh, such a weird game. <laughs> anyway, so you can just keep doing this over and over, and what you can do is you can... Put on like Netflix on your phone and just watch something while just spamming right trigger. You just mute your TV or something and you just keep spamming right trigger and you don't even really have to move. You I, I'm not even moving, I'm standing in one spot and so that you guys know exactly where I'm standing is right here. Where the rim is, you'll see this circle kind of going around. I'm just standing right here at the rim, and right in front of me is this shadow right here. Um, casting the shadow is the symbol of Skyrim, of course. It's a dragon. Um, you're going to want to stand like right here, because he will just keep pushing back. If you push him back, he'll just keep walking back to that spot right there. And you just keep swinging away. You just keep doing this, and you can get it up to level 30, 40, 50. Eventually, it just keeps getting slower and slower, though. It's slower and slower to level up after a while, and that's just the way of Skyrim. All right, I hope everybody liked this tip and trick video. Make sure you like if you liked it, dislike if you disliked it, comment, comment, subscribe, and share if you want to go the extra mile. Make sure if you do subscribe, you hit the all on the notifications bell so you get notified when all my uploads go live. I mainly do Skyrim. Uh, what are you doing? related things right now. I do a lot of Let's Plays for different kinds of games. But um, we're going to see you next time in the next video. Hey, I have been the Lonely Doctor of Time Lord Gaming. I'll see you later. What are you doing?